Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to transform this lime green pool into clean fresh water. Hey there buddy! We went out on vacation and our pool stayed um, without turning on the pump and without its chemicals so we came back to this of course and as you can see you cannot see the bottom it's completely green but that's a beautiful sunset. So this is what it looks like on the morning we started cleaning it and this is what it looks after. I'm going to show you how to make it look like this. So for my size pool, I will add two of your Clorox Blue Deep Shock and I will sprinkle it all over the pool. I will do one side first and then I will do the other side. And as you can see here, it immediately starts to work. And these are the one pound bags and you can find them anywhere. I'll put a link down in the description below if you need one. And this advice is the best I can give you when it comes to cleaning your above ground pool is adding a magic eraser to the filter. It works like a charm. I've tried it so many times now and it works effectively and fast. Now I'm adding two gallons of your liquid chlorine. While I was adding the chemicals, my husband was helping me skim the pool. Now what I'm going to do is attach my water hose to the brush because you want to stir it up the bottom of the pool. When we added the shock crystals, it trapped all of the algae in it and it sink to the bottom. And we want to make sure it rises up so the filter can do its job and filter out all the algae. You want to brush the bottom of your pool like so. If you have a vacuum specialized like for the pools, you can use that as well. It also works great, but I don't have it. So this is what I do. See, you can see right here how all the algae is floating up to the top and that's what you want to filter out. This is what you want to achieve. You want the algae to float to the top. You want to make sure you brush all your pool throughout. And as you can see, it has only been 30 minutes since we started this whole process and our pool is looking so much clearer than when we started. Now you want to let it filter for about two hours and this is a result when we came back to check on it. And at this point what you want to do is you want to change your filter and you want to change your magic eraser. You want to add a new one. This is the filter that we just took out out of the pool and as you can see it's green. So now we have come back in about another hour and this is how our pool is looking. It is the end of the day and this is how our pool is looking. We have been cleaning it for five hours now and changed the filter twice but my kids are so ready to go in to the pool and we did. We let them go in. So this is the next day. So we went from a green lime nasty pool to this refreshing clean water and it was such a nice day also we enjoyed our pool so much so i hope this video can help you 
to bring your pool back to life and I hope you enjoy it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and I'll see you in the next video. Bye! This is what it looks on the bottom of the floor now. You're able to see the floor, the water is so nice and clean. At this point, if you wanted to, you could also add a water clarifier but it's just fine for me. I don't need to add it, but you can if you like. So I'll leave that link down below as well. Bye, hope you guys have a nice day. Thanks for watching.